You think we're going to beat all these games? Nope. Backlog Boys. No, probably not. Found a new place. Hey, welcome back. There was a little, uh... There was an opening at the Holiday Power Inn. bomb at the top here that we could get yeah, through. Yeah, we're over by where we got the ice beam. And there's a part of the floor where you can use an ice beam to get through. And we just got the map right before we started the episode. Which apparently we didn't have. Um, so there's a couple I, rooms I that we realize. just haven't gotten in, in Norfair. Yeah, and so far everything has required the charge beam. So maybe this will lead us... Or not the charge beam, the uh, grapple beam. Okay. Uh, this is looking promising. In we go. This is leading us to the, like the back side mm -hmm. of that room we were trying to get to. So this would be a great location for the chart for the grapple beam. And then we grapple to get out. That yeah, would, exactly. That makes sense. Game design. Game wow. design 101, starring the B-Boys. Samus. And Samus. Oh my gosh, the lag. So yes. It's so real. Chase him down. You got him. Dog the bounty hunter over Chasing here. Chasing born. Wow. Yep. Oh, I can dash through that. Probably should have done that. Going back for it. Mm. Sounds like uh, one of the sounds from Chrono Trigger. The powering up of that? Yeah. Wait, is this did that Wait. just make a big loop? It did just make a big loop. So nothing... What the heck, of, man? Of, ...of much importance there. Yeah. What's over hmm. here? This is... This room that leads to... Welcome to uh, stumped.exe. Stump.net. Yeah. Oh, excuse so there's me. A, there's that thing below here, but I look, that looks like the other side of the room. That's the other side of the boss yep. room. So that where can't... we know that there's something. I'm just gonna go for it. With just a... gonna try to like run across it. Yeah, I'm just gonna dash jump. Um, because you can jump pretty far when you're got the speed boost going. And now that I have health again, yeah, I can, I can probably, probably do something here. Whoa. Well, well. Well, tank energy. Okay. <laughs> well, we'll Cheating. take it. And still a little grapple stuff on the top. Yeah. Hmm. I don't that's, know. That's got to be somewhere close by. Yeah. Because everything needs grappling. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of areas we've seen now that need it. But I don't know where to get it. Um, is there somewhere over to the left here that we didn't go? Oh, yeah, down there. That's where I was thinking we were just a second ago. Dang it. Oh, when we went through the long hallway. Yeah, I was thinking it was leading to that. But we didn't go down that far. So, this room, mm -hmm. we managed to cheese our way across. Yep. And then, what's down here to the left? What are we looking at? Gotta remind myself what's in here. Ah, yes. A super missile thing that we can't get through. So, the missile just hits the wall there? Yeah, it doesn't go through the barrier like the beam does. So if we go down here... Oh, well, that was nice. That was also nice. Um, Fruze those guys. Hmm. Fruze them. Fruzen. Disney's Fruzen. <laughs> Starring Olga and Randy. Randy. <laughs> the two hot princesses. Oh, Randy's a princess? Princess Randy, yeah. Princess Randy. Because they're, you know... Disney's trying to be forward thinking, so they're doing this non gender specific thing. Okay. So they're gonna have the first male Disney princess. You know, he's a boy named Randy, but he actually identifies as a princess. Okay. So trying to Disney trying to be inclusive. Props props to them for that. Sure. Yeah. A brave, brave move. How do we get up there? I feel like we can cheese it. But these go down. Which is not good. Not good, no. Because then you can't get back. And you can't make it down and you have to jump out your seat. I, I just noticed that those are like supposed to be like hanging in between pillars. That's kind of cool. Do you think they are? Well, yeah, because they like, they're like all in between two pillars. Oh, and like, they slide like down. implying that that's like a thing like jutting out towards the camera. Yeah. I see. What, cool. I see what you're doing here. I, I see like what it. you got, got your brain working on. My noodle. Yeah, I see what your noodle's, picking away at noodles with going. ice picks at the thing. Wow. Um, stumped again. Stump.net. There's nothing through here. Yeah, we tried that once. There's really no way up there 
besides the uh, the grapple place. And the only other place we can go over is over there, which was. Well, hold on a second, because at the top of there, it's clearly an exit. You can only go through there from the other side with a super missile. So there has to be some way to get to this door from this side, from this room. Is there a way? And there's not even a way to get up there. Even with wall kicks, because there's this huge negative edge here. So, God, stupid lava, get out of here. So how else would you even do it? Why would this all even be here if you couldn't do something? Yeah. There's got to be something. Unless it's like the screw attack. Hit the door. That's pretty sweet. Wait, you hit what? I hit the door. By, like I can. Oh, for, oh, you can shoot it from all the way down there. Yeah. It goes. So it goes through everything. Yeah, the beam goes through everything once you have the wave beam. The power beam doesn't, but the wave beam does. Well, ah, jeez. The wavy bomb. Yeah, we have significant level of beam. How do you get to the top of this room? I guess maybe that door up there is an exit too. But how would you um how would you get there? Super confused by that. You have to go the other way around, which we can't do as well. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. This is like a catch twenty two. Or like a, a paradox or something. <laughs> a time paradox. You've created a time paradox. Um what's through here? That's just a long... Some kind of dead end. Um, Alright, let's go back up here again. I think it has to be this side, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Man, um, we are just getting... Oh. Yeah, you can't shoot it through the wall. It really seems like there's got to be something you can do at the bottom here, because... It like makes you fall down, mm -hmm. you know, and doesn't really give you a good way to get back up other than wall kicks. Yep. So, what are we missing here? There was just a missile expansion at the end of this room. Nothing special. And we have the map, which I think would show any kind of like hidden stuff yep. that we're missing. Yep. So, what's, the, what's the deal here? Excuse me, everyone. Do you know which way to the grapple beam? Hello. I'm not from around here. Which way? Uh, to the grapple beam. Oh, God. I'm going to go down here one more time. This just doesn't make sense to me that there's nothing you can do from this room. I don't buy it. Would it really make us get the grapple beam in an entirely separate place and then bring it all the way back here? Oh, absolutely. I mean, we've done that with a lot of the items we got so far, like the power bomb and... So it could just be somewhere else altogether. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Is, this, it, is there game. worth maybe going to another planet and exploring then? Yeah, we probably should. I just... This is irking me. Because this room makes no sense. Oh, press the wrong button. Oh. Crackhead In. done got a hold to the wrong stuff. Taking this women that hot tub lava. This the Metroid hot tub. Yeah, you can't get up there. You can't do it, man. No, I don't think so. That ledge is way too steep. Unless you can make these guys go up somehow, but they just go down. Sometimes they go up, sometimes they go down. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, jeez. Hmm. Okay. Well, we'll go somewhere else. See what we can turn up on some other spot of the map. You know, when you really, 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 really look at it, the, uh, when the background, when you're looking at the background and the foreground moves, it's mm -hmm. a little unsettling. Yeah? Yeah. Well, this doesn't actually have that. Like, the background and the foreground are moving at the same speed. No, because it's kind of like scrolling the the background. Right, but it's scrolling at the at a same rate. It's scro it's not scrolling at a different rate what? though. It's scrolling at the same rate as the foreground. Hmm. 
But it's, they Come move. on! You almost had it. There. I think they're a little bit offset. It, maybe it is slightly offset, but it's not as offset as it could be. To, like, it's the same in this room. To give it's you just two images. To give you that really pseudo 3D it, depth yeah. thing that yeah, they do in like Super Mario World and stuff. I was actually just watching a uh, animation thing from Studio Ghibli, like old Studio Ghibli. Oh really? Where they were showing like all this crazy tech that went into like three seconds of footage for these certain shots where it's like, you know, it's like the camera's panning, but there is no camera. So they have to like simulate all that. And they have these like three feet long, like paintings of landscapes. And then they put like the animated cells over the top of it and like oh. move it a millimeter, you know, and then take a picture. And like, that's how they create the shot. And it's just for like five seconds of footage. And it probably took them like a couple of months to do it. It's crazy. Wow. Super cool. So much it's dedication. Studio Ghibli. They're great. Wow. Big fans. We are, I think we are both. We've established <clears throat> we're both fans. Oh, absolutely. And in this room. Yeah, I feel like I could just cheese across it, depending on how long it is. Uh, tomorrow on The Boys, we'll find out we'll if we've got what it takes. We'll put the theory to the test. See if Austin comes home with the big bucks tonight. <laughs>